Understanding Leverage Analysis in Simple Terms Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to explore an interesting business term, leverage analysis. This might sound a bit complex, but don't worry, I'll break it down for you in simple terms. Whether you're a student, a professional, or just curious about business terminology, this video will help you understand what leverage analysis means and how it's used in real-world contexts. Let's start by understanding the word leverage. In the simplest terms, leverage involves using something to its maximum advantage. In the business world, leverage usually refers to the use of borrowed money or debt to increase the potential return of an investment. Think of it as using a small force to move a large object, similar to how a lever works in physics. Now, let's dive into leverage analysis. This term combines our understanding of leverage with analysis, which is a detailed examination of something. So, leverage analysis is the process of examining how debt is used in a company and understanding its impact on the company's profitability and risks. It's like a health checkup for a company's financial strategies. Understanding the importance of leverage analysis is key. This analysis helps companies make informed decisions about how much debt to take on. Too much debt can be risky, while too little might mean missed opportunities. By analyzing leverage, companies aim to find a balance that maximizes profits without taking on too much risk. To solidify our understanding, let's look at a real-world example. Imagine a company that takes a loan to buy new machinery. Leverage analysis would help this company understand if the expected increase in production and revenue from the new machinery is worth the additional debt and interest payments. And that's a wrap on leverage analysis. I hope this video has shed light on this interesting business concept and made it easier to understand. Always remember, Learning new terms not only expands your vocabulary but also your understanding of different domains. Thanks for watching, and I look forward to exploring more exciting topics with you. Keep learning and stay curious.